Are you ready for the jaw-dropping exploration into the shocking truth about inequality? This isn't your ordinary video. We're diving headfirst into the mind-blowing concept that Aristotle laid bare. The worst form of inequality is to try to make unequal things equal. Prepare to have your mind blown as we unravel the mysteries behind this explosive statement. This video is about to turn your understanding of inequality upside down. Buckle up. We're about to embark on an unforgettable journey of intellectual discovery. Let's dive in. Imagine, if you will, a world where everyone is treated exactly the same, where differences are ignored, and individuality is brushed aside. At first glance, it might seem like an idyllic notion, a utopian dream where equality reigns supreme. But let's take a closer look. Aristotle invites us to question this seemingly noble pursuit of making unequal things equal. You see, equality is not about treating everyone in the exact same way, for that would be to overlook the unique qualities and circumstances that make us who we are. Each of us possesses different strengths, weaknesses, talents, and experiences. We are born into diverse backgrounds, cultures, and social structures. Trying to make unequal things equal disregards the fundamental truth of our individuality. Think of it this way. Imagine a classroom where all students are given the same standardized test, regardless of their abilities or interests. Is that fair? Is that truly equal? No, it's not. It fails to acknowledge the inherent diversity within the classroom, the varying levels of aptitude and potential. To create a truly equitable educational environment, we must recognize and cater to the unique needs and abilities of each student. Aristotle's insight invites us to embrace a different kind of equality, one that celebrates diversity and acknowledges the inherent differences among individuals. It is a call to recognize that true equality lies in providing everyone with equal opportunities to flourish according to their own capabilities and potentials. It is about creating a society that values and nurtures the inherent talents and contributions of each person. Let's take a moment to reflect on the world of sports. Would it be fair to pit an amateur athlete against a seasoned professional in a competition and expect them to perform equally? No, that would be absurd. The professional athlete has invested years of practice, honing their skills and developing their talent. To demand that they perform at the same level as an amateur would be an injustice. True equality in sports lies in providing opportunities for individuals to compete within their respective skill levels and categories, allowing each person to showcase their abilities. Now let's turn our attention to the realm of social justice. The pursuit of equality should not be a blind quest to make everyone the same. It should be a fight against discrimination, oppression, and unfair treatment based on factors such as race, gender, or socioeconomic status. True equality means advocating for the dismantling of systemic barriers and ensuring that everyone has equal access to resources, opportunities, and justice. It is about striving for fairness and inclusivity, while still acknowledging and celebrating the diversity that makes our world vibrant and beautiful. So, my friends, let's challenge the notion that making unequal things equal is the pinnacle of equality. Instead, let us embrace a more nuanced understanding of equality that respects and celebrates our individual differences. Let's strive for a society that values and uplifts each person, providing equal opportunities for growth and development. By recognizing and embracing the unique qualities within ourselves and others, we can create a world where true equality thrives. In essence, Aristotle's words serve as a powerful reminder that the worst form of inequality is the attempt to homogenize and force sameness upon inherently unequal things. Let's embrace a more enlightened approach to equality, one that recognizes and celebrates the diversity and unique qualities that make each of us who we are. Together, we can build a society that fosters fairness, justice, and the flourishing of every individual, regardless of their differences.